Unbelievable, but this is actually a game from Endless. And more unbelievable. I can't even pass second level. And it is supposed to be a game for kids. Anyway, it is called White House, and it is available on Flathub. The game is developed on Unity, and probably they didn't pay for a license, so we get the logo. That reminds me Ubuntu, and it pisses me off already. First, you need to change the graphics settings, and by the way, that is version 0.37. Goal of the game, is to kill and destroy with the power of CSS. And of course, the main and only character, is a woman. The controls are ASDW for walking, space for jump, and mouse for camera movement. So, the game starts with a paintball gun, and we can paint all the objects around us. We have 6 slots that we can add different colors. But later on the game we get more items, and it gets too much complicated for me, as you will see. The graphics are not exactly great, then someone will say that's not the point. But then again, it is a game after all. Anyway. To pass the first room, we just need to paint the door, with any color. Then, the game is giving us some hints. For example, here we should paint the door blue, for opening it. And by the way, we should press H for opening the color selection. And then H again to close it. You can't imagine how much annoying that is. So, here we have a green carpet. And a pink monitor. And some random pink. And last object, is the blue closet. And level was completed successfully. Now we get another tool. And I'm telling you. I spent 10 minutes, and I have absolutely no idea how it works. I assume we could write something, like objects' names, but no idea how. You see, everything started wrong from the very beginning, with that Unity logo, and they will end up the same bad, with a rage quit. Like they kiss 